All right, guys, what's up? It's it's me, Chef Andy, back again with another episode of Minecraft, the only chef on YouTube serving up good gameplay. And today, I've decided that we're going to do some more improvement on our villager trading hall because we have these guys, and only one of these guys seems to reset every once in a while. And I had that issue with these guys. And you'll probably notice this is a different setup. I've got a bunch of composters. Well, wait. Got a bunch of composters here underneath some carpets and they will find random workstations it's a bug right now currently that the villagers will lose their workstation and randomly pick a new one that's close by so these guys will lose this and then try to pick a different one but they won't find a different one and, and sometimes they won't find that one so with these guys they're all on top of six composters and they reset quite often and what I've been doing is just steadily gathering up some emeralds thanks to my melon and pumpkin farm and the carrot farm these farmers are by far the best source for gaining free emeralds right but uh, we, you know I like to trade these guys for redstone sometimes I get glowstone and pearls off of them the experience can be handy too uh, so like having these guys reset and maybe having more of them would be really awesome. So I kind of want to like rework These guys workstation and I'd probably take out this redstone here for this line. I did take I did remove uh, all of the redstone except for This one right uh, I just wired this up to a lever instead of a pressure plate so whenever I want to add more farmers cured I just open this and they'll come into here. But if I close this, right, the trapdoor closes and the, the activator rail up there depowers, right? Same circuit I had before, just not operated by a pressure plate, I just ran a switch underneath here. So I'll do the same, same thing probably. I'll just have them all come in through here and remove this redstone from up here and make like a little little room for these guys to reset so yeah maybe something like this would be okay so what I'm gonna do is probably remove a bunch of this redstone here yeah look at that okay cut out a little place for these guys to exist hello Cole I'll just leave that coal there I don't really give quite too much about it care about the coal there. Alright, let's remove that. This guy's gonna immediately path over to his buddy here, right? They still can't get out because of the trap door. If I can get him out of the way here. Alright. Uh, did you really? Guys, are you that stupid? Okay. Like, I have to ask. Come on up here, idiots. Friends. You gotta be kidding me, right? Like, Here, have something to be interested in. Go path to your brewing stand. Oh, boy. Well, one of them thinks he's gonna go. Gotta give him a little nudge, I guess. Not what I wanted. Okay, alright. Now I just gotta get you out of there. Yay, look at that. Oh, isn't, isn't that much better for you? Right. So. First off, let's get carpets. I'm gonna use blue carpet, I think. The harsh reality is we, we're very short on blaze rods, right, For the, to make brewing stands with, so. I was gonna say, can I even place a carpet there? Is that possible? 
All right, so the, the, the theory behind this is we'll have some carpets there. Uh, actually... stone blocks, but not to worry. Hey guy, come on, relax. You know, get off of here. Get on the carpets, would you? See, they don't like to be on the carpets unless you force them <clears throat> onto the carpets. Get this guy out of this little square here. Easily. Easier said than done, apparently. Why are you, like, clinging to that square, my dude? Get over here. Oh, I got an idea. Oh, jeez, did I really just do that? Oh. So I gotta have a block there. I have blocks there. Let's see, with these guys, they needed. They can't really path onto this block right here because of this. Okay, that should allow them to path better. Um, so I need three spaces above the carpet for them to be able to go onto the carpet. Uh, which is going to be a problem, so. I gotta fix those rails up there too. Ugh. Maybe I won't be able to do this. Maybe I can't do this for them. Or I could have them be lower, be down low. But that would cut into some redstone issue. Maybe just four brewing stands? Or... They fall in here and walk down. Can you walk? He can't walk down there, can he? Oh, he's pushing me to the maximum. He will not let me go in that block. Okay, I can take that one out. Does he... Can he, like, let me in? Okay. You get down there too, buddy. Why can't I just walk in here? Is it because of this carpet? It is, I have to crouch. I have to crouch to get in here because of the trap door. Well, because they're on carpets, right, I can remove that trap door now. All right, we are learning. Oh, no, then, then he can escape. No, 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 you stay. He saw his opportunity. He was trying to bolt. Okay. So we need some type of stairs. Is this is. All right. Let me. Let me figure this out, and we'll come back, and I'll show you the finished room design when I figure this stuff out. All right, guys. Uh, so. I did a little bit of testing, and it turns out um, <clears throat> we can have top slabs above these guys while they're standing on carpets. And under these five carpets or five brewing stands, 
uh, this spot has redstone under it, so I really can't put a brewing stand there. And I don't know if they can access this one truly, because I need that solid block there for the trapdoor, because uh, there's a repeater behind it. Uh, and I gotta get up there and fix the rails, too. But this lever's all wired up. I couldn't put it here, because it was next to this guy and his redstone, so I had to put it over here. But that's okay. Yeah, let's get up there and fix those rails. Yes. This is it. Alright, so to fix this one, we just had this one here. And this is for the farmers. Annoying. Alright. This is the shepherd. Mr. Shepherd, get back in your hole. first place. Alright. Piston, where'd you go? Here's where these goons come in, right? So we need a detector, or activator, right here. We need a... regular rail here no 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 here anymore. Regular rail goes here. What do we have powered rail here? Uh, if those were powered... Right, so we took out the activator here. Uh, we need a regular. That's going to be a problem. There we go. That's better. We're going to replace that. We need a rail here. Guys, let me know if you like watching me mess with redstone stuff, because, uh, I don't know, sometimes people don't. They don't like seeing the process, you know what I mean? Um, Alright, so that's open.
regular rail going through here. Perfect. Our rail should be all fixed now. guys I think we did it I think we've got everything all set up these guys should reset a lot quicker a lot easier oh everybody's starting to reset now let's see what we can He's maxed. Alright, let's see if these guys reset. They should. Before they weren't. Uh, not very reliably. Look at that. Right on time. So now technically we can flip this lever. Cure a couple clerics. Send them down the line. They'll come in here as long as this lever is powered. They'll just go into this chamber with these goons. And I can have up to, I guess, five or six guys in here. They'll share the same workstations like these farmers do. And it is kind of open here. I don't know. I guess I don't mind it being open because they, re they really they can't get out. But uh, I don't think they're in any danger here. I guess I don't need these guys to be cluttered either. They could be wide open. Uh, so yeah, I mean, that's that's pretty much it, guys. That's the video in a nutshell. So let me, let me know what you think down in the comments below. Um, if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe to me, Chef Andy, the one and only chef on YouTube serving up good gameplay. And... Also, share with your friends. Share me on Facebook, share me on Twitter, share me on Snapchat, um, and don't forget to uh, take a look at my my entire page on my channel and, and see if you find any other gameplay videos that you might like. But anyway, that's it for me, guys. Uh, I just wanted to show you this real quick adaptation to my villager farm, or villager hall, rather. And uh, I hope you enjoyed. I hope it helps you out. I hope it solves your problems with villagers in your world. And uh, yeah, so we'll see you next time. Bye bye. Schlitzbites.